Vanderbilt playing host here in Music City, USA, and for the first time since 1982, CBS cameras are here. Hello, senior, big time cornerback for this Vanderbilt team in single safety. And the boot is to him at the four yard line. Powell is dumped down at the 22 yard line. That Damian Swan, number five, has been burned in recent weeks. He's up against Kraus now. Carter Samuels on the crossing pattern, incomplete. Matthews, that kindly is up at the top of your screen, his favorite target. And underneath, he goes to Green out of the backfield. Both of these guys are very, very good catching passes coming out of the backfield. Four wide receivers and Green, the lone setback, will take it. Rel relatively conservative call by Georgia. Kyle Westman made the stop number 92. We've got a marketing percent of it, but Georgia has been very effective with their opportunity. And here's Green making the most of it. Inside the 10 to the seven yard line. Kenny Ladler looking for Conley. And he stopped at the four yard line. Well defensed by Ladler, who's off to a really good start. And Andy of forcing the field goal and holding up in the rush. Special teams have been an adventure for Georgia. Remember the muff snap that they had in the game? Inverted running back at LSU back in the day. On first down. Over the middle, Matthews again. He loves that scene route right down Broadway. And at the tight end spot. Second and 13. Carlos Samuels decides to tuck it and run. Knocked out just inside the twin tight end look. They love power out of this. Seymour has the first down and then some. Seymour now at quarterback. Here we go. A little flip reverse to Matthews. Boy, he may not be fast, but he's a wonderful open field runner, George. Seymour, nice move, touchdown. The team has in its special teams, Kerry Spear. He's in for the extra point. More on that coming later. As an 11 play, sees ever known. That's saying something. Saying a lot. J.J. Green negotiates for a couple of yards and a first down. Here's the uh, fullback. He looks to uh, open a hole for him, and he does. All the way to a first down, just as we mentioned it. And making it very hard for Georgia to run the football. Loss of three, so second and 13. And the pitch is to Douglas into the boundary. Look at him go. Yet another first down inside. Coming to the end of the first quarter as Douglas finds an absolute huge hole. He takes it all the way to the goal line. Could it be a touchdown? That late surge. Freshman is setting the tone for these guys. Yeah, they went quick. They went fast. And Murray burrowed. Back on the board with a much needed touchdown. Just as we touched on their inability to run the football, they go power. All the way from really midfield. Samuel's legs. Oh, he did. Right on cue, partner, for the first down. Out to the 45 yard line. Statistically, a chance to go mano a mano with a guy like Murray is special for him, too. Krause, he's got it. Acrobatic catch at the 39 yard line of Georgia. Because Todd Grantham was coming after guys. There's Krause again. Another first down. Usher down. Looks like a mismatch. Connor Samuels tucks it instead and takes it down near the two. Free spear from 20 yards out. Out of the hold of Taylor Hudson. Trick play beautifully. Young man that uh, had to quit soccer, Kerry Spear, because of. Uh, dumps it underneath the hitch, just nothing there. Darian Herring 
and Kimbrough has moved in at setback. Actually ran into Carter Samuels. He still makes the pass, and it's Trent Pruitt. Pruitt out ahead of the 45 to the 47. Another just about the vertical part of the game, but also the width as they go. A little Emery and Henry. It's oh! Intercepted by Shaq Wiggins. Take that for your kitchen sink. Defensive line was still running over there late. Shaq Wiggins single-handedly could have turned this football. Here's Patton Robinette in at quarterback now. Out of the backfield, Seymour. And Jerron Seymour out to near the 20-yard line. J.J. Green in at tailback on first down. Murray has Conley, who figures to be the guy he'd go to. Part of the impact, but... Uh, all of the leg was in question, no question. And Brendan Douglas takes it down to the 25. And off of this, they need to stop here because the momentum has shifted. One of five on third down conversions. Murray, that's complete to Davis at the 11-yard line. Murray, runner pass, he'll take it in, touchdown. Brilliant play, and why not leave it in his hands? He used his legs to find and get the touchdown. Marshall Morgan for the extra point. He's two of eight on third down conversions for Georgia. To bring five. And again, the slant. Complete to Connolly. And he's into Vanderbilt territory at the 40 yard line. Now let's go back to the start. Early on in this game, if you're the Commodores. Douglas again, huge hole. Look at that, yards after contact, too, by Double Deuce. Douglas. McGowan, 27, with the catch at the five. But I don't think they can run it down here. For Conley, knocked away by Andre Howe. That was a fire zone look, and they dropped Walker. Marshall Morgan from 23 yards away. Georgia Seymour trying to stretch it out. Oh, did he will himself to that first down? Second and a long four. Again, they go Wildcat with Robinette flanking to the top of the screen. Seymour is patient this time. Sets sail down the sidelines inside the Georgia 45. Down to the 42. Uh, bringing his team from down 13. Quick off, it's picked off. Tipped right into the air and picked off. George has got to throw it here. Murray had to just get rid of that one. That's a that's more coverage than anything. To a coach calling guys by numbers. <laughs> Robinette incomplete. Trying to go underneath to Matthews. Extra from Virginia. Gets it off inside as 10. Damian Swan loses it. There's the break Vanderbilt needed. It's a muff, so it will come back to the 36-yard line. And the rookie it all here on third down. Run it. Robinette tucks it, gets it up to about the 30, and that is all. He uh, had he had an opportunity, Tim. He's got time, and he just had it dislodged. It was Krause that got hammered, and here comes the flag. Might we have targeting again? It was Remy. Coaches are the ones that are on the rules committee. All right, here we go. First and ten. Quick out. Matthews has got it with a blocker, and he's inside the ten. Not a seen ticky-tack, but safety is the most important issue, and for that, I applaud him. Robinette decides to tuck it, and he's just shy of the first down. He's at the six, the line to make the five. Cap him, draw him off sides. Seymour. He will see more. First and goal. The two, second and goal. Robinette again. Touchdown, Vanderbilt.
had trouble converting on third down, and that penalty was a huge, huge help for him. Here comes pressure. He gets it away incomplete. It was Herring again, who's having a marvelous game. Jerron Seymour dots the eye behind Quintero, the H-back. First down for Robinette. Looking long, taking his shot. He's got his man. And guess who they're picking on? Swamp. See that Vanderbilt starting to go hurry up. They feel the momentum shift, and they're trying to take advantage of it. Robinette decides to keep it. And uh, as George is going from in the middle. Robinette's pass is caught by Cross at the 15. First down, Commodores. On this next play. Looking for Cross. Ball is tipped by Swan. Give him credit. Quarterback number 29. They'll try from 40 yards. This would close the gap and does to three, which is important. You're trying to get themselves off the field. Butler blitzing. Douglas takes it. He's stuffed. Well, the door has certainly been left open by Georgia. High snap. Uh -oh. Special teams problems. Vanderbilt will have it at the 13 yard line. Special team woes continue to be a huge... Especially since they can still get the first down down here as well. Seymour. Oh, 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 nice. A little jitterbug! Jerron Seymour gives Vanderbilt the lead. Look at the defense, Tim. Stunned. I mean, you talk about quick feet. That's a little dance and go. Dance <laughs> and go. Let go of me. You're... Tim's up here. <laughs> And Georgia will now be forced to score a touchdown. It's a big break for Georgia. He was smelling a pick and then tried to pull back, committed the, the foul. Brendan Douglas in the backfield for Georgia on first down. He's got it underneath. Oh, it's the football. Vanderbilt's got it. Andre Howe. Redemption for the young man from Louisiana. He's the man that... And the boot is hooked. And leaves time. Arguably the biggest ever for him in this stadium. Murray. This is it. Last play of the game. That will do it. Vanderbilt gets their first win over a ranked opponent. In six years, Javon Marshall ends it with the pick. And Conley is down on the final play of the game. Is that not symbolic? Johnny Football and the seventh great Aggies of Texas AM. For our entire crew, Tim Brando saying so long. This has been a presentation of CBS Sports.